Kentucky's new governor taking office very soon. Governor-elect Matt Bevin and Lieutenant Governor-elect Janine Hampton will be sworn in during a private ceremony just before midnight tonight. Their public inauguration will take place tomorrow, along with a lot of celebrations. WKYT's Monique Blair shows us how the new governor will be celebrated. In just about an hour, Governor-elect Matt Bevin and Lieutenant Governor-elect Janine Hampton will be sworn into office in a private ceremony. And then tomorrow, the celebrations will be open to the public. It's the beautiful uh, example of the peaceful passing of power. In addition to many traditions for governor inaugural celebrations, such as a morning worship service, a parade, and a public swearing-in ceremony, this year, history will also be made. It'll be a part of the history books because Janine Hampton is the first ever African American to be elected and sworn into statewide office in Kentucky. Inaugural event planner Kenny Bishop says roughly 3,000 people are expected to attend Tuesday's events, and with that comes added security. We are going above and beyond with every asset and resource that we have available, including augmenting with extra manpower at the inauguration to ensure that Governor Bevin's inauguration goes without a hitch. The National Guard, Frankfurt Police, State Police, agents with the FBI, ATF, and Homeland Security will make a presence Tuesday. State police are asking anyone attending the events on Tuesday to be very vigilant and aware of their surroundings, but police also stress they have spent quite a bit of time and resources to make sure the public safety is not at risk. In Frankfurt, Monique Blair, WKYT. WKYT's Bill Bryant will anchor live coverage of the public swearing in tomorrow. You can watch it beginning at 2 on the CW Lexington. It will also stream live on WKYT.com and in the WKYT News app.